All right, so let's learn about four expressions. So four expressions allow us to kind of iterate over something and do something fun with it. And so what we're going to do is create ourselves um, some more complex types here. So how about instead of like, this was just hello a second ago, but we'll change this over to worlds. And what I'm gonna do is just list out a bunch of worlds here from the, uh, the book, uh, you know, John Carter books. So we have Barsoon, we have Jasum, we have things like Sasum, okay? And then we have, whoops, Sasum, and then we have something like Kosum, okay? And so the idea here is, now that we've defined that there, we've gotta go back to our main TF. I'm just going to update this to be uh, worlds. This will just be a list, all right? And so what we'll do is make our way over to Terraform Cloud, or sorry, Terraform Console, and we'll try to do a for loop here. So I'm gonna do square braces, for, and we'll just say w in var dot worlds. And then what we can do here is make a colon, whoops. Okay, and then type upper w. And so that returns them all in uppercase there. And if we were to use the splat operator, and technically this is something we want to move on to the next part, but um, uh, yeah, we'll leave it for the next video. I'll just keep that separate. So that is for just if we had a list. Imagine if we had this as the as an index here, um, or we'll say map, because what we can do is actually map these two names. So we'll bring this down here. And this would be earth. Now you can use the colon or the equals, it's just whatever you wanna use here. They're both supported. Actually, this is an earth, this is Mars. And then this one here is earth. And this one here would be Jupiter. And then this one here would be Venus. Okay. Um, and so I think we still need to define it over here. So I'm just gonna say world's map. And then what we can do here, instead of having list, we can say map. And we'll try to iterate over this. So it's gonna be very similar, except the difference is now we have a key and we have a value. And so if we just want to return the names in capital, we can just do K here. Oh, that's the index. Uh, what if we do? Oh, you know why? It's because um, we have to do world's map. Okay. So reference to undeclared variable map. So we do have to exit and restart. And oh, sorry, the input was complaining there. So I'll just copy the one up here. So I don't have to type it again. Nope, it did not work as we thought. Okay, so I do have to type it by hand. Kind of a pain, but I guess that's just how it works. So we'll say 4k v in var dot worlds map. And then we say upper v here. Okay, or we could just say take the k here and get the other values. Now, I didn't show you this a moment ago, but if we do worlds here, uh, we can specify an index. And an index would come first, so it would be the value like the world is second and the index is first. So notice that I is all a number, the index of it, and then the that is the value there. Um, we could probably also return this as a map. So notice that square braces are gonna give you a list or, uh, and then uh, curlies are gonna give you map, which kind of correspond to their actual data structure. So if we wanted to turn this into uh, the opposite here, what we could do is just say, uh, we'd probably do string interpolation like this here and do I and then do equals or even maybe uh, a colon here and then do the world like that. And it didn't like the way I specified it. So I'll try it like this instead. Um, extra characters after the line four. So I don't see that wrong there. Just give me a moment. I think, um, Oh, you know what? It's We need to use, in this case, I think we have to do it this way. Okay, so we use, use the hash rocket. So in that particular case, you have to use the hash rocket. That's what that symbol's called, the equals arrow. 
Um, and so that's how we can get that value there. So that pretty much outlines how to use um, the for loops. And next we're gonna go probably look at the splats, okay? So I'll see you back here in a moment. I'm just gonna exit this. Actually, before we move on to splats, I just want to add one more thing to four expressions, which is filtering. So we'll just go back here and get back into our Terraform console here. And uh, what I'm gonna do is just write another four. And it probably would make sense to use the uh, the, the worlds list we just did there. So I'm gonna do KV, uh, type in var worlds map. And so the idea here is that I only want the, um, let's say, we'll say the upper, I only want the uh, key value here, but I would just say at the end here, I can say if the v the value equals, and I can't remember what we set these as. So this is key and value. So if it is Mars, I think it's double equal. So if it is Mars, then only return it that way. Or we could say the opposite, say, give me everything but Mars. Okay, so I just wanted to show you, you could use that if to do that filtering. So I'm gonna exit there and we'll move on to splats, okay?